We don't know if the Higgs particle exists or not, but to find out, scientists have built the biggest particle accelerator ever. <laughs> I'm standing 100 metres below the ground at CERN in Geneva and this is the CMS detector, part of the largest and most complicated scientific experiment ever attempted. Here, we'll recreate the conditions that were present in the universe less than a billionth of a second after the Big Bang. How do we recreate those extreme conditions here on Earth? Well, you need one of these, the Large Hadron Collider. 27 kilometers in circumference and filled with over 2,000 superconducting magnets, each at 1.9 Kelvin. That means that they're colder than the space between the stars. Inside here, we accelerate protons to 99.999999% the speed of light before bringing them into collision inside four giant detectors. The LHC is going to be exploring totally unknown territory, but that doesn't mean to say we have not got some ideas of what might be there. And one of the most famous examples is the idea of the Higgs boson. And this, according to theory, is a manifestation of what happened when the universe froze. Now, I don't mean froze like at ice temperatures, I'm talking about 10 with 17 zeros after it degrees. That before that time, according to our best theories, the universe was in a state of beautiful symmetry, whereas today it's full of structure. And just as the structure of the snowflake emerges when water freezes, so, in our theories, the structure of what we call the standard model of particles and forces emerges when the universe froze at this incredibly high temperature.